welcome back to the channel newcomers go ahead and push that red subscribe button and join the family as you can see for me it's morning time it's breakfast time and even when it's not breakfast it's always good i want to make a breakfast scramble something simple and easy that you can make even you know some people that are out of school on spring break or whatever's going on something simple and easy you can throw together that's really good now as you can see here the hot dogs are going to be my extra because I got two left in the refrigerator. Don't want them going away, so I'm going to cut them up and throw those in there because you're not even going to notice. We're going to use these um, potatoes and onions. You get those in the frozen section. We're going to use some beef sausage, five or six eggs, some uh, mushrooms, and onions. Let's just get all this cut up, and we're going to start putting it in the pan. All right, people, we've got the oil in the pan, and we had some assistance. We got all of our vegetables are cut up. We're about to go ahead and put these potatoes in and as they start to brown, we're going to get the rest of these vegetables in that pot. Okay. Going ahead and putting these vegetables in. We're going to go ahead and really just start dumping it all in, make it easier on you and me. Okay. So, and we've got that bag of potatoes open. We're going to definitely get that pouring in. Okay. We went ahead and used the whole bag of that. Okay. The green peppers in there. Okay. The eggs. That eggs are going to be the last thing going in. But we're going to try to make this quick and easy. We're going to go ahead and dump that meat in there and everything. Add some more oil to that. Put that top on it and let that kind of cook itself. Yeah, we're going to make it real easy on you guys today. Anybody can do this one. This is not even going to be a hard one whatsoever. So you don't even have to worry. And of course, we've got our Old Faithful avocado oil. You're going to be taking at least a tablespoon, if not two tablespoons of this, and putting it in here and moving that around. Avocado is a good oil, so don't even stress yourself about it. Okay, let's stir this up. Okay, this is what we want. You just want to keep stirring this up. Now, take this and cover this up and let it cook a bit by itself. And then we'll come back to it. All right. Now it's just this simple. There you go. Look at that. Getting yeah, the burn on it. Let's go. That's what we're talking about. Getting the burn on the meat. Okay, now you're going to just add your cheese or whatever. Man, and once oh, that melts girl. in, once that melts in, you're pretty much done. You're ready for your toast or whatever you're going to eat this with. But of course, at this point, we're not done because we want to add some eggs and we're going to add all six of those eggs that just is determined by how many people you're cooking for you add your eggs mix them in and like i said once that's done and your cheese melts get ready because it is delicious okay The yolk, stir them around, and you're you. This this will be cooking up. Okay. All right. You see that there, people? That egg is all around in there. 
Now just add your cheese. Any kind will do. Yeah, see, it's cooking that egg really well. By the time you add on your little cheese, it's good to go. Put that top on it, melt away. And this baby's ready. All right. That right there is done, people. Delicious. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. Try this out. Tell me how you liked it. Put down in the comments what ingredient you took out the refrigerator to add to it so it didn't get wasted. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.